what's up YouTube. Make sure to like the video, really helps the channel out. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, hit the bell and share. Help me hit a thousand subs so I can start live streaming and doing exclusive giveaways through Super Chats to keep the Zippo Mafia alive. Hey, what's up YouTube? I got a very special video for you today. This is going to be my one year review on Zippo Fanatic 77's Zippo Bag Trick on a lighter. And today I'm going to be featuring my Sterling Silver Vintage Look Zippo. As you guys can see, it is freshly filled up and I do actually have a bag trick on it already, guys. However, I'm gonna first off explain some of the benefits of having the bag trick when exactly I started using the bag trick, which for those of you who don't know, it should be pretty obvious by this video was about a year ago. But for those of you who didn't, I'll just once again tell you it was about a year ago. Now, Zippo Fanatic, I believe, came out with this possibly even two years prior to a year ago. I am not exactly sure, guys. I would have to go back and look on his channel when exactly he came out with the bag trick. However, guys, I have a confession to make. Once again, I didn't actually start using it until several years after he came out with it. I'm gonna be honest, because when I carry a normal Zippo just to fix that writing up issue that the inserts have on modern Zippos, especially guys, like as you guys can see, because this has the Zippo bag trick in it, it does not ride up whatsoever. And I, I cannot say enough good things about this bag trick because it not only does it double your fuel life in the winter and in the summer, at least add another four or five days at bare minimum to your fuel life, but it stops that annoying insert from riding up. Because guys, modern day Zippo inserts, they're loose. In my opinion, they're way too loose. Zippo, if you want my honest opinion, needs to go back to the flat stock insert that's much tighter and actually fits in their lighter cases. But this virtually solves that problem. So I'm going to go ahead and remove this insert from this Zippo and we are going to put a new bag trick on this lighter. Now you guys can see, this is actually prior to before I started using the bags that I'm gonna show you now. This is actually a sandwich bag. Actually, it, it actually might even be a freezer bag, guys, because this is actually really fucking thick plastic. However, I really don't remember, guys, because I had this on this Zippo all the way back in I believe April is when I put this on this lighter. Then I stopped carrying it once it started running out of fluid and then I just put it up in its sterling silver Zippo case and never even looked behind me. But anyway, so the bags I use now guys, instead of going to the grocery store, granted you can get a lot of life out of your sandwich bags or freezer bags that you use. You can utilize basically almost the entire bag except for the part on the top that seals However, for me, I can get these insulin supply bags for free because I'm type 1 diabetic. So that's what I use as my Zippo Fanatic 77 bag trick. So what I'm going to go ahead and do, because I don't have any scissors, guys, is I'm going to cut about that much. And guys, this does not have to be beautiful. It doesn't have to. All we want is a piece of plastic that is going to successfully cover the bottom of our Zippo insert. So let's say something like that, and then we'll stab this part. And then we can just rip that off, guys. And then we have our nice little piece of plastic. And what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna take your Zippo insert. And what this is gonna do, guys, is this is gonna create a perfect little seal inside up against the lighter case and the bottom of the Zippo, it's gonna seal off the exit because guys, this is what happens when you carry a Zippo without a bag trick on it. As you guys know, it's just cotton. There's no sort of rubber seal. The metal doesn't go all the way around and have a little screw that you have to put the lighter fluid in. It's just a felt pad. And that's what winds up having all your Zippo lighter fluid evaporate within a week, week and a half. So what we're gonna wanna do is just hold it like this and 
basically just push it back in there. And even with this plastic, guys, this plastic is nowhere near as thick as this. And watch this. Watch that insert. Minimal writing up of the insert. And guys, that honestly makes me love this even more than saving me money on lighter fluid. Just the fact that I don't have to bend with a dime the insert of your Zippo. Because when you do that, guys, especially on a sterling silver lighter that's going to start wearing down the case of your Zippo. And you definitely don't want to do that with silver because silver is a very, very soft metal. So you want to have something that's going to, yes, provide you with it to prevent it from riding up but you don't want something that is gonna wind up wearing down your silver and eventually possibly even damaging the lighter case itself over the years. And that's where Zippo Fanatics bag trick comes in perfectly. Now again, guys, I've been using this for about a year and in the winter time, I can get up to, granted guys, I do have organic cotton that has not been bleached inside of this. I can get up to three weeks out of my Zippo. Now in the winter without a bag trick, let's say on this Zippo, I would get about a week, maybe a week and a couple days. Because guys, I don't live all the way up in Canada where Zippo Fanatic lives, so I don't actually have to endure quite as severe colds as up there. So of course, the cooler climate, the longer your lighter fluid is gonna last. However, with the bag trick in the winter, upwards of three weeks. One time, guys, I even got almost a month out of it. And that was with regular Zippo Rayon. Now, granted, guys, I wasn't using the Zippo quite that often. But I just... Props to Zippo Fanatic 77, guys, because this bag trick works phenomenally. Like, I, I can't honestly believe that I waited that long just to decide to cut up a bag or an insulin supply bag and actually try out the Zippo bag trick for myself. Because it's just, it's like, why, why wouldn't you want to use that? I mean, you're getting longer fuel life, guys. Saving money. Because that's the biggest Zippo flaw that exists on the Zippo is the fact that the fluid can evaporate. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it for this video. If you like the video, like, share, comment, subscribe, anything you do helps, and I will see you in the next video. Hey, what's up, guys? Excuse me. I know I already filmed the video. However, I have this little extra tidbit to add on to the end, guys, because I honestly forgot to actually mention this in the video. Want, guys, once I hit a thousand subscribers, I want to give away this sterling silver 1990s plated Zippo. Now, it's not a solid sterling silver, anything like that, guys, but it's still a really cool Zippo. And coincidentally enough, it actually came out of Canada. Funny little backstory to it. When I was buying it, I didn't actually realize it was coming from Canada until it didn't show up until a month after I bought it. And then I looked on the package. Sure enough, it said Canada. Anyway, guys, I'm going to show you the date code. Everything. It's not filled up or anything, guys. I really don't... I'm not really that big of a fan of this lighter, to tell you the truth, guys. That's why I'm going to give it away. And also, just to help you guys out. You know, I really want to start giving back to the community once I hit 1,000 subscribers. But as far as I mean, I don't really like it. Just because once you've gone to a full sterling silver Zippo, you really don't want to go back to anything like this. Which, in my case, is what happened. But as you guys can see, that's the insert. It is a well-used Zippo, guys. It's not like it's brand new or anything. However, I think this would be a perfect debut to give away on my first live stream after I hit 1,000 subscribers. And yes, Zippo Fanatic will be there. So guys... That's going to do it.
Okay guys, now for the real outro. I want to thank you guys for watching. If you want to like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, anything you do helps, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.